Hey there, Stefan from MaxFit. Uh, today with me, Les. Hi, Stefan. How, how are you doing? Good. Today we're going to talk about shoulder pain. Uh, okay, so a lot of people suffer from shoulder pain. Um, why is this and how can we prevent this? Well, first of all, it's all about posture. Uh, a lot of people are in front of the computer the whole day. They have their phone, they're playing games, uh, Pokemon Go or whatever, texting. Les and I, we also love to drive our motorbikes and that's also a lot of pressure on the handlebars and the shoulders. So what happens? Yeah, the muscles in the front are getting very, very strong and tight and short and the uh, muscles on the back, they're getting kind of weak and long. So this unbalanced muscles in the shoulders will cause a lot of problems in the, in the future. Uh, for example, if you want to lift something above the head, uh, if you want to paint your, your ceiling, or uh, if you go to the gym and you do certain exercises. So what can we do about this? Uh, three steps we're going to take and we're going to show you today. Uh, step number one, I'm going to massage less. No, I'm not going to massage less. <laughs> and step number two is um, focusing on the right stretching exercises, gentle stretches you can do at home or in the office or wherever you are. And number three is to find the right exercises to strengthen the muscles. And that's very important too. So Les, are you ready? Ready to go. All right, lie down on the floor, I will massage you. <laughs> All right, the first step is massaging the muscles, getting a better circulation. Uh, bad news for you, Les, I'm not going to massage you. We're going to do it with uh, the tennis balls. It's very inconvenient if you bring your masseuse to your, to your gym or to your office, right? I mean, it's Thailand, massages are cheap, but let's use the tennis balls. Okay, so we place the two tennis balls right here on the shoulder joint. Don't put, put it down on the spine, just right next to the spine. Yeah, and then you're going to go down, lie down on the floor. There you go. Head goes all the way down to the floor. And then what we're going to do is we're going to move up and down with those arms. Slowly, gentle. Do this for around 10 times. So what happens right now, those tennis balls really push into the tight muscles. It kind of hurts a bit, right Les? Yes. Same as a massage. How more pain, how more the uh, uh, yeah, muscles are, are tight. So the second part, you're going to bring your arms on the floor, palms facing up, and you're going to bring them all the way above the head as far as you can and back down to the hips. Again, how more pain you feel in the shoulders, how tighter your shoulders are and how actually uh, more you need this. So do this for around 10 times each. Uh, after that, I want you to bend the knees and push with your legs, your body a little bit more up. So the ball, balls go a little bit lower. Yeah. So less you push with your legs, your body up. So change direction of the ball. Yeah. All right. Then the second part, stretching the shoulders properly. How do you feel less after the massage? That was quite painful. Actually. <laughs> <laughs> so let's do this. Uh, we're going to call this the reach roll lift. So you're going to sit back on the ankles. Then the elbows are on the floor. Uh, we're reaching out with one arm, then rotate the palms of your arms facing up, up to the ceiling. And then what you're gonna do without bending the elbow is bringing the arm up as high as you can. There you go. Bring the arm back slowly and repeat it with the other arm or alternate it with the other arm. So what this does, it really gets a good stretch here on the backside of the, of the shoulders. And remember, uh, I told you that those shoulders or those muscles are yeah, most of the times pretty tight. This is a really good way to stretch those shoulders there. Do it very gentle, okay? Don't do this too fast and don't push yourself up too high. So again, repeat this for like around 10 reps. All right, guys, so this is the third part again. Strengthen the muscles, the shoulder, the back, uh, inside the gym. So you have access to dumbbells. This is great. This is one of my best exercises. Uh, Les is gonna show you. We call it the dumbbell rows. Uh, we're just going to lie down on the inclined bench. We're going to grab the dumbbells and pull them all the way up to the chest. So this is a very good exercise because it kind of isolates everything else. You, you cannot really cheat with this one. The most important thing is that your chest stays on the bench. And when you bring your arms up, you're going to kind of squeeze your shoulder blades together. So you're really activating the muscles on the back. Backside of the shoulder. 
uh, the inner, inner muscles in the back right here. There you go. So complete around 10 or 12 reps and then you can increase the weight a little bit more. Uh, I want you to focus on like four or five sets, okay? Four or five sets of 10 repetitions. So once you get the hang of this, you can increase your weight every set, all right? Just use a little bit more weight. Very important, extend those arms all the way out and row all the way up. Okay, very good. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching and thank you, Les, to uh, help me today. Some great tips, thank you very much. Excellent. If you want more tips and more information about fitness, then visit our website right here. Thank you all and speak to you soon.